I think capital is scarce in Africa, specifically capital in certain pockets. Um, so if we just talk about the investment landscape in South Africa for a minute again, um, you know, the equity markets are, are really well structured and, 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 and operate well. The big private equity funds operate well, listings, mergers, delistings, all of that stuff. But as soon as you get to a market capitalization of uh, 20 million US dollars and below, there's just a scarcity of capital. And, and the reason for that is also because you need some non-financial investment to unlock the financial capital. You know, these are typical entrepreneurs that have done something right and they, they are building a great business, but now they're running into those type of things that they've never seen before. You know, they've never, they've never put together an executive leadership team. They've never registered a patent. They've never had to think about how to structure the balance sheet for growth. Um, they don't know a corporate banker um, or, a, or a, haven't met a good merger lawyer. Or, or um, so, so I think, you know, we, we, uh, where we see the great opportunities to come, actually come alongside those uh, entrepreneurs and, and help them. Before you get to different industries, just generically in terms of size of the company, that's where the jobs are being created. That's what could change the country as well. Um, but it is from a pure commercial investment management business perspective, it is messy. It's not as scalable as just investing capital and, and getting some reports every quarter of how the company is doing. It means seeing companies on a monthly basis, being there for them, rolling up your sleeves a bit. So I think that probably is, is a little bit different from the first world because we don't have the same level of social capital. Many of the entrepreneurs didn't grow up in a family where the, the dad was speaking about business at the, at the dinner table. Um, and and that, is, that is where I see the biggest void.